Olympia then was very different than Olympia now. The early structures were made mostly of logs. Later structures were constructed from new lumber the mills were producing. Even later, structures were constructed of stone, quarried in Yelm and Tenaya. The most dramatic differences in Olympia can be seen in this 1879 E.S. Grover lithograph. Grover drew from the hill above Daniel Bigelow's house and farm. From Bigelow's home, which has been a continuous residence for the family since it was constructed, we can easily see the changes that have taken place in the early neighborhood and in the city below. Well, times have changed. I never really looked at this thing before. We have a copy of it up on the wall, but it's shortened fit the picture frame. There's the house you were born in. It's a nursing home. Here's our house. This East Bay Drive. One goes into a swamp and a lake. You remember when we were first married and we used to go for a walk down there and it was a swamp and somebody left a picnic table and you wouldn't let me have it? Everything belongs to somebody. <laughs> well, right? the, the thing that's interesting to me is how it's changed when Grandpa went to town. It was just a couple of blocks across the bay here, but before these bridges were built, he had just to go on a trail clear up way around the end of the water, way up here. That'd be clear around what's the watershed now. Yeah, and clear back down. Clear back so down that'd be a, town like a half a day trip almost. No wonder he took the canoe at the bottom of the hill. Here is the Methodist church, the first Methodist church at the corner of Fourth and Adams. And that was built from lumber that Reverend DeVore got from the Crosby Mill way up here. And at high tide, he floated it clear down. Pike pulled it all the way down here. Now, he had to get yeah, it out yeah, through here get through because what there. is now the lake was tide flats. And, and clear, clear around, around the point. And, and now, of course, it, this bridge may not have been there then. He There's got it within a... Um, he got it close enough so he could build a church there. It's a whole church. Yeah, that's where... Um, There's a bridge Old across Kay it. Melton used to live in that little swale. He was famous because he endorsed a hair restorer, and it was all in all the magazines. Okay, no. don't Nelton. have any name at all to identify them. No, Guyatt's house might have been here. The old house, that looks like it. Huh. And they built, yeah, see, there's that building they built behind there that, I think they took it down not long ago. There's the old Tumwater Church over here. It looks just the yeah. same as it does now, and to think it was built apparently before 1879. You remember when we used to go out there to the chicken dinners the oh, ladies did oh. every month? And the lady was so elegant, and she would say, please retain your fork. <laughs> that was really interesting. Now, you see, that's, it's, it's very odd to live in one place this long and watch everything else change. You and I never change, you understand, but everything else does. Uh, I would like to see some sort of a kernel, a core to Olympia that would not only preserve, but preserve in a workable way the old center. We've got so many things that need protection, and sometimes it's just too late to do it. I don't know about our house, which is in a continual state of genteel decay, and nothing cataclysmic since some of the plaster fell down some 20 years ago, but uh, other places that there are that really should be kept. This whole area had to grow. It just had to grow. It's the southern end of the Alaska Inside Passage. The, you couldn't in those days go east without going south. West was a wilderness. It had to go through here, north and south. And it was an important area, the first town on the Sound, first customs house. And it's still as valuable, and I would like to see it kept. At the same time, I like progress as well as the next one, but it has to be a mix that's carefully thought out. 
I'm glad I married you. Brought all this on. <laughs> I'm glad you brought it to somebody's attention. <laughs> <laughs> well, how could you not? These things are important.